चलो गाइस वी आर गोइंग टू सी प्रोप्टोसिस ओके प्रोप्टोसिस प्रोप्टोसिस आउट फॉरवर्ड फॉलिंग ओके मीन्स आई आई विल कम आउट न द प्रोटेशन ऑफ द आई बॉल इज नोन एज प्रोप्टोसिस इट इज अ कंडीशन वेर देर इज फॉरवर्ड डिस्प्लेसमेंट ऑफ द आई बॉल बियॉन्ड ऑर्बिटल मार्जिन विद द पेशेंट लुकिंग स्ट्रेट अहेड ओके इट इज द प्रोटेशन ऑफ द आई बॉल फ्रॉम दी सुपरा सुपरा ऑर्बिटल मार्जिन एंड इनफीरा ऑर्बिटल मार्जिन ओके द आई विल मूव फॉरवर्ड वट आर द क्लासिफिकेशन इट इज क्लासिफाइड ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ ऑन साइट लोकेशन लैटरलिटी एंड इटियोलॉजी ओके ऑन साइट इज सडन और ग्रेजुअल लोकेशन इज एक्जेल और एक्सेंट्रिक लैटरलिटी दट इज यूनिलेटरल बाय लैटरल एंड बेस्ड ऑन द इटियोलॉजी ओके फर्स्ट कमिंग टू द वट आर द कॉजेस फॉर यूनिलेटरल प्रोप्टोसिस ओके इट मे बी कंजेनेटल दैट इज फॉर डर्मोइड कंजेनेटल सिस्टिक आई बॉल एंड ऑर्बिटल टेरेटोमा ओके डर्मोइड कॉन्जेटल सिस्टिक आई बॉल ऑर्बिटल टेरेटोमा इन्फ्लामेटरी लाइक ऑर्बिटल सेलुलर ऑर्बिटल सेलुलाइटिस नेक्स्ट इज फॉर वैस्कुलर इट मे इट इज रेट्रो ऑर्बिटल ह्यूमरेज ऑर्बिटल वेरेसिस और ह्यूमेंजियोमा लाइक सिस्ट ऑफ ऑर्बिट आर पैरासाइटिक सिस्ट हाइड्रेटिड सिस्ट और सिस्टी सर्कोसिस ओके नेक्स्ट फॉर ट्यूमर्स आर प्राइमरी सेकेंडरी एंड मेटास्टेसिक ट्यूमर्स म्यूकोसिल आर फ्रंटल म्यूकोसिल इथमोडल म्यूकोसिल एंड मैक्जिलरी म्यूकोसिल ओके नो कमिंग फॉर कॉज फॉर बायोलेट्रल प्रोप्टोसिस Uh, better take uh, write write in a paper so that you can remember okay for bilateral proptosis it is for a developmental anomalies of the skull like craniofacial dystosis example oxyencephaly and crozen syndrome osteopathy is like osteoderma frans rickets and acromegaly inflammatory like uh, cavernous sinus thrombosis endocrine exothalamus uh, endocrine exothalamus like thyrotropic and thyrotoxic uh, tumors are lymphoma lymphosarcoma secondary uh, secondary tumors of neuroblastoma and leukemia infiltrate systemic diseases like amyloidosis that is abnormal protein deposition of agnus granulomatosis okay causes of acute proptosis uh, means a proptosis within a short period of time are orbital emphysema fracture of the medial orbital wall orbital hemorrhage and rupture of rupture of ethmoid ep- mucosal okay causes for intermittent proptosis, proptosis means they will come and go intermittently orbital varices periodic orbital edema recurrent orbital hemorrhage and high vascular highly vascular tumors okay causes for pulsating pulsating proptosis pulsating means something is pulsating pulse is seen in blood vessels means something related to blood vessel pulsating vascular lesions cavernous sinus uh, ca- uh, carotico cavernous fistula secondary aneurysm of ophthalmic artery intermittent cerebral, cerebral pulsation due to deficient orbital roof meningoencephalocele neurofibromatosis okay these are like facts things okay so, so that uh, you, uh, make anyone can remember by yourself now come to investigation what all you will do first you will do clinical evalu- evaluation then laboratory investigation imaging techniques you will do then histopathological examination okay clinical ex- examination a person will come to you with uh, proptosis means i uh, a bigger eye you will do history taking local examination systemic examination history we will ask age of onset duration progression and associated symptoms local examination will do inspection palpation auscultation trans illumination okay so that to, to rule out whether any flu Fluid is there or any solid tumor is there inside inside of that? Okay. Next, visual acuity. Vision is impaired or not? Pupillary reaction. It is delayed. RAPD or something we we can check. Fundus fundus examination. Uh, ocular motility. Is there any restriction to the movement of the eyeball? We will check. Exophthalmometry. Like how much the eye move forward? We can check. Okay. Systemic examination to look for thyrotoxicosis or tumor elsewhere. Histopathological examination. uh we we can do fnac or incisional biopsy or excisional biopsy management is by artificial tear te- drops gonadotropin 5 uh, 5% eye drops for lead retraction systemic steroid lateral tersography okay uh, lateral tersography it is a surgical technique next is quint surgery uh, or orbital decompression okay as there is restriction of the uh, eyeball movement we, we need to do quint surgery tear dro- tear drops gonadotropin 5 5% eye drops systemic steroid lo- local tersography okay once again uh, sudden uh, sudden or uh, based on the onset sudden or gradual axial or eccentric unilateral or bilateral okay unilateral it may be congenital inflammatory vascular cystic uh, tumors or mucosal bilateral it may be anomalies of the skull osteopathy uh, inflammatory endocrine uh, like uh, thyrotoxicosis tumors and uh, systemic diseases okay same thing investigation will do clinical evaluation laboratory investigation imaging uh, imaging techniques non invasive and invasive histopathological examination okay That's it. See you in the next video. Until then, Jai Hind, Jai Bharat.
Uh, so uh, I forgot to add add on the first is proptosis. Proptosis means forward falling. Okay, it is mostly unilateral and occur in any age, and both the sexes are affected. Okay, etiology is variable. You already know that inflammation, tumor, everything is there. Passive protrusion due to space occupying lesions. Okay, that is neurocystic sarcosis. Exophthalmus is exoph means outward eye. Okay, mostly bilateral condition and 20 to 40 years of age group. Mostly affected are female. Okay, thyroid diseases are more seen in females. Mostly endocrinal endocrinal dynamic processes. Uh, dynamic dynamic process due to active changes taking places in muscles and tissues of the orbit okay there is a in exophthalmos like thyrotoxicosis you already know there is restriction of the movement and there is a swelling of the uh, behind the eye okay that is orbital fat and the muscles of muscles are get swelled there okay this is difference between proptosis and exophthalmos bye bye